Hello again, it's Dr. Denton with Salisbury Eye Care and Eyewear, and today I have a special treat for you. So I do a lot of dry eye treatment and management, and I was recently told about a new piece of equipment that can show you what the doctor is looking at when we look at your eyes. One of the tests I use to evaluate dryness is called tear breakup time. It is simply done by having the patient blink and hold their eyes open as I count in my head and wait for their tears to break up. This test can be done manually just by your doctor using the slit lamp. Because we don't blink constantly, it's very important for our tears to hold up in between our blinks. So the tear breakup test is just one test I use to evaluate whether your eyes might be getting dry or not. I'd like to show you an example of this tear breakup test from your doctor's perspective. Our first subject is one of my employees, Kristen. Kristen's eyes, she reports, are rarely dry. She has pretty normal vision. It doesn't tend to fluctuate. And so I'd like you to take a look at her tear breakup time. You'll notice that Kristen was able to keep her eyes open for over 20 seconds and her tears barely broke up. You'll see a little bit of breaking up at around 12 or 13 seconds, but all in all, Kristen's got a great tear breakup score because in between blinks, she'll maintain good tears. The next one I wanna show you is another of my team members, Brittany. Brittany has had very dry eyes for a long time and you'll notice as you look at her tear breakup time that they break up almost instantly. The spots where her tears are breaking up are those red patches and they are all over the front of her cornea. What that means for Brittany is that her tears are just breaking up rapidly. She's going to blink and feel dry almost instantly. She would benefit from some dry eye intervention which is something we would have to tailor to her needs specifically. So here at Salisbury Eye Care and Eyewear, dry eye is one of my passions. I really enjoy finding dry eye, treating dry eye, and most importantly, making my patients feel comfortable so that they can do what they need to do all day without interference from uncomfortable dry eyes. If you would like more information about dryness, feel free to contact our office. You can make an appointment online, and if you're not from this area, just go ahead and like and subscribe our page. We'd love to have you follow along with us. Until next time, bye.